Hey guys, this is Barn Geek. We get a lot of questions about this boom. This video I'm going to cover, it's a homemade boom I bought in an auction sale. So I don't have any idea where you would get it. Maybe it's not homemade, maybe it's manufactured, but we're going to go through and measure the different pieces and uh, maybe you can replicate it yourself. So. Anywho, it is, looks like approximately uh, 90 inches at the top, and this hook is about 82 inches at the bottom of the hook there. So then we'll, so we'll just start from there and go on the way down. We've got a, a two I-beams here. Got one here and one here. Looks like this top I beam is uh, three inches by two and a half, and it is a total of uh, just on 71 inches long. 71 inches long. Okay, and then uh, it's got an angle at the end there. All right, and then there's uh, another I-beam. This is like, looks like this one's four inches. Yep, four inches. And by two and three quarters inches wide. And then it is, let's see here. A hundred and, well, let's see. You got 102 at the top of the angle, about a hundred and, Four and a half at the bottom of the angle, roughly. Okay, and we'll go through. It looks like it's got holes drilled in the uh, um, I beam with half inch plates, I think, on both sides of the hole there. But anyway, half it reinforced with half inch plates, three of them, and then hooks. Looks like they're probably half inch hook or holes. Let's let's put that there and see if people can see it. Five eighths maybe, something like that. Okay, and then this these plates are two inches by of course uh, three inches it looks like. Okay, and then there's a gusset right here. Looks like quarter inch. It's five and a half by four and a quarter. Probably the same on both sides, I would assume. This looks like two by two square stock. Okay, and this has an angle on it, so let's get you the height right here from the from the bottom of this square stock. Up to here looks like 50 inches to that point, 53 and a half to this point. Okay, so this angle or this angled piece is whoops. Is 53 inches long roughly. Let's let's get a little closer here. 52 and a half. Okay. And then so you got two of those and then it looks like this might be two and a half inch. Yep, two and a half inch square stock in the center here. And that's another piece of two and a half inch square at the bottom. And of course, it looks like a quarter inch gusset right here. That might even be three eighths, it's heavy. Anywho, this uh, bottom piece is 34 inches across. Okay. And then you have a... Um, A support, a brace, I guess is what I would say, that goes across here, and that is uh, 29 inches, it appears. Okay, and then, um, and of course, this brace on the back, we'll go ahead and measure that. More 2 by 2 here. Looks like it is 27 inches. No, uh, maybe. 26 inches to 
that point there. Okay, that's two more two by two. Looks look like two and a half. And that looks like it's 23 and a half. Of course, you know, you can see the metric measurements on there too if you're a metric guy. And then of course, I'm sure this is probably the same distance here as it is in the front, 34 inches. Another piece of two and a half. And then uh, these things, I'm gonna go ahead and tip it down here. It is heavy, but these, uh, where the forks go, are 10 inches by, looks like three inches roughly, square tubing. And then there's a plate welded right here on the bottom, looks like quarter inch, and that's two inches by, you know, nine and a half. Okay. I think I covered everything, didn't we, Zeke? Oh, we got this little strap on the top here. I'm not tipping that back up. This little strap here looks like it's one inch strap that's kind of bent around here and welded. Reinforcement, so that's... Thanks for watching build one yourself i hope you do it's heavy <laughs> but it sure does the job i don't think there's anything i couldn't lift with this thing as long as the tractor was strong enough i wouldn't be afraid to put my truck underneath it and lift it that but my tractor wouldn't lift it up so you got a bigger tractor though but anyway have a great day thanks for watching catch you on the next video